Welcome to the Yes to Life show where my brother and I share delicious and healthy vegan fitness recipes and today we're making a cream made with sprouted lentils. If you haven't seen our video on how to sprout lentils, make sure to check that out. I love sprouted lentils because the taste is really strong, earthy and delicious. And of course, it's rich in proteins, vitamins, minerals, all the good stuff. I have right here one cup of sprouted lentils and I'm going to combine it with beans, parsley, olive oil, garlic and so on until you get that nice creamy paste which you can use on top of some bread for instance. You can dip vegetables inside or the lentil crackers that we did in another video, whatever you like. So the process is really easy. Once you have all of your ingredients in place, you just mix them in your food processor, blend and that's it. It's that easy. So we start with the lentils. I'm going to add them to my food processor. And then I'm going to add half an onion and two cloves of garlic. If you don't like garlic that much, use one clove. If you love garlic even more than I do, use three or four. Up to you. It just brings out the garlic flavor. I take one cup of white beans, cooked white beans, of course. Uh, you can try other types of beans as well. I just think that, first of all, the color is very subtle and the flavor as well, and it goes good with the lentils because the lentils have a strong flavor and the white beans will tone that flavor down a little bit. And now we're gonna add some parsley. I have around yeah, a handful. And then we're gonna use the juice of one lemon. I take one tablespoon of olive oil. To flavor it, I use cumin. And this is around half a teaspoon. Cumin does have a strong pungent flavor. So if it's too strong for you, use less. If you like cumin, use more, obviously. And then just give it a big pinch of salt and a big pinch of pepper. Now you also need some water to adjust the consistency. I'd recommend around a quarter cup. But what I do usually is I start blending it first. I see how the consistency turns out and then I adjust the water afterwards. So let's blend first and then add the water. So now for my taste, it actually doesn't need any water anymore, but we can a little bit, but in this case, just one to two tablespoons. And as I told you, adjust it to your preference. If you like it really creamy, add more. If you like it like thicker, this could just be fine. It might also depend on the water content of your sprout lentils on the white beans. So it always depends a little bit on your individual case. Now at this point, it's time for you to taste it because you can adjust it to fit your preference. I'm going to try right now. I think this is pretty good. It, can, it could have some more lemon juice, I think. But apart from that, I like it a lot. You can adjust the oil, you can adjust the lemon juice, salt, pepper, whatever you like. Now I'm going to transfer that to a container and you can keep it in the fridge for up to five days, but you probably eat it anyways before that. So there you have your delicious, high protein and healthy lentil spread with sprouted lentils. If you did like this video, please leave a like and a comment down below. If you haven't, subscribe to the channel for more videos like that in the future. Thank you for watching as always and hope to see you next time.